welcome back to my channel. Now today, obviously, I have a guest with me, and have you, you've been on my channel before. I've you been on a food video. Food video. Is that it? I don't know. That might I feel be. like I've been on your channel a lot. Well, to everyone who doesn't know, this is my friend Kendall. Hello, guys. And Kendall is now a fellow YouTuber. Yes. Originally a blogger. Yes. And just a very stylish, all around oh, person. thank you. And I've been friends with Kendall now for like the last, I don't even know, like in person, like six months, something like that. Yes. Eight months. We grew very close very fast. Yeah, yeah, we really clicked. You might be able to tell from our personalities <laughs> in this. They're very similar. Kendall has become very fast, like a little sister of mine. Aww. Like I joke, I'm like, you're the third little sister in my family. So I knew for my 30th birthday, mm -hmm. I wanted to do a huge shopping spree. Like a full on, I was like, I want a full on new wardrobe. Or yeah. like enough pieces to really just amplify up everything yeah. I already had. I mean, it's your 30th birthday. You have to go big. And I went so, oh my God, guys, I went so big. Look, I'm actually actually kind of scared and a little embarrassed to show you because it's so much stuff. And that being said, whether or not I keep this in the video, I feel like I need to say this. The elephant in the room is the fact that like you guys have obviously made everything in my life possible. Every time I move, oh, yeah. every time I pay for my groceries at the store, every time I go shopping, whatever, you guys are the reason that I'm able Aww. to literally pay my bills and live my life. And I feel like I should be saying thank you to you guys at the start of this because um, you updated my wardrobe. Yeah. So, oh, oh, I didn't explain to you why oh. Kendall's here. Oh, yeah. So, when I decided I wanted to I'm do the shopping spree, I literally was like, where do I even begin? I felt really overwhelmed time-wise. Shopping just takes time. It takes a lot of time. And it takes knowledge to know like where to go for certain items. So, Kendall actually, she made this into a video on her channel. So yeah, go, go check it out. Below. I basically said to Kendall, like, Hey, so I love your style. I think that you're so cute. Obviously, she is, you're, you're a little bit younger than me, but I feel like you're also very mature. Thank you. And I love her style so much. So I said, hey, would you mind helping me doing some shopping? And she got really excited. My favorite thing to do ever. She became like my personal shopper. Like she basically put together all of these outfits online on her blog for me to go through and shop. So honestly, probably 50% of the items is all from stuff that Kendall had like shown me so Yay. that's why she's here yes so do you want to tell them about your video yes yeah, so my video I go through the process of what I did to shop for Nikki so I put myself into like Nikki's shoes and what Nikki would like and then I go through different shows uh, different stores shows different, blah, 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 blah. different stores online and got things from like budget to like pricier things from like Tilly's to free people and I wanted to show her a range of items you can get and make outfits look just as great in any price range. Okay, now yeah. I'm gonna kick her out. Bye guys. You, she's actually gonna watch me film this haul <laughs> and be sure after this to go over and check out Kendall's video because I think you're also gonna be sharing like tips, huh? Yes. Yeah, tips so on tips. Online shopping. Tips on online shopping. And now the reason I kicked her out is because we obviously talk a lot. So I'm gonna try to go through this pretty quick. The first piece that I got from Free People, this doesn't even look like a dress. Like hopefully I can get this on. <laughs> I am so excited about this dress. I not only love the color, but on top of that, the cut, even though literally Dan and I spent 20 minutes in the bathroom one night, I'm not even kidding, trying to figure out how to get this thing on. It is so beautiful and I actually am going to Mexico and I will be vlogging it next month. Unfortunately, it's on Kendall's birthday, but I will wow. be in Mexico. And this is definitely gonna be a Mexico dress. So I'm lovingly calling this like my nurse dress. Um, I haven't worn this one yet, but I know I'm gonna get a lot of wear this summer. It's super cute. I feel like I said, it kind of looks like I'm a nurse, but like a really cool, like, not that all nurses aren't cool, but like the color I feel like gives a very cool nurse vibe. And I feel like I'm gonna wear this with like either boots or even just like my white Converse and like um, my uh, Ray-Bans, what are they called, Club Masters? I just, I think it's really cool. Okay, so this is also a free people item, which is also kind of like nurse dress number two, but maybe this nurse is from like the 40s. And it's this like candy red, like peppermint kind of dress and this, once again, I'm a Converse girl. I would totally wear this with my white Converse. And I feel like it's just super cute, super casual. And I love dresses so much because you don't have to put any thought into your outfit. You just like get dressed and go. Another free people dress that I got, guys. This is super cool. Dan actually really liked this dress, which I was kind of surprised. I don't know why I didn't expect this to be like his taste. But it's, is it inside out? It is not inside out. It is a jersey kind of 
dress. It looks almost like a sport. I don't even know how to describe this. It's very sporty kind of. This is super cute. I like how casual it is. And it's just one piece. You're done. You're dressed. I like the purple and the blue color combo. Okay, so my next piece. I've never ordered anything from showmeyourmoomoo.com, but I see people talk about it all the time. And so I got this. I also picture myself wearing this in Mexico and all through the summer because here in Southern California, we get like a hundred and something degrees in the summer. But look at how cute this romper is. I don't know like what this flower is, but it's just, I love floral print. Like I love floral print a little too much. I just think it's so pretty, so feminine. So and cool. I know a lot of this, I actually bought way more off Show Me Your Moomoo and I had to return legitimately like half of it because it was really weird fit for my body. But the pieces that I kept are so cute. And every time I've worn them, people are like, oh my gosh, where'd you get that? So, okay, another free people dress. This is definitely gonna be like either a summer nights mm -hmm. kind of dress because it's literally like an oversized sweatshirt with like a peplum kind of bottom. Um, I could see myself wearing this like summer nights with like some vans, like the sleeves pulled up by a bonfire. I'm like painting a whole scene. Um, or in the fall, I could totally wear this with like black tights, black booties, have like, I don't even know what else over it, but I just really like it. Kendall just pointed out the pockets. There are pockets on this dress, which makes all dresses yeah, better. even better. And this is Free People, but it says Free People Beach. So apparently they have a beach line and apparently this dress is from that beach line. I'm so excited to wear this in Mexico and at the beach all summer. And it's this cut out white, like kind of creamy white Free People dress. The cutouts all around the center, isn't that so cute? I love it so much and legitimately I'm just like picturing myself frolicking on the beats, beats, the beach of Mexico <gasps> next month. It's gonna be so fun. Um, I've worn a lot of this. That's why also you're not seeing things in bags. Also because everything I did was online shopping or 90% of it was all online shopping. So this next dress is from Free People. I wore it actually in my dog's morning routine, which if you didn't see that video, I feel like that video just didn't get a ton of views because the thumbnail wasn't the most amazing, but it's one of the cutest videos I've ever done. She chimed in that it's cute too, so you should go check it out. But um, this is also from Free People and it's like, it's kind of like a slip, like it's very soft like a slip, but it's not so thin that you can't wear it out. Plus all of my dresses in summer, I wear all dresses with biker shorts underneath because to me the idea of a dress is to be able to like fly around like a little girl and just be fun and happy. But if you're wearing just a thong or whatever, then it changes the whole situation with the dress. So um, it's so pretty. And I love it. I love the coloring. I love the flowiness. I got this at Target in, um, where was I? Nashville. The I'm like, where was I at recently? So this is just a romper, as you can see. I never like this color on myself, but something about this tone, I thought the color worked really well. And when I tried this on at the Target, I wore it with red high top Converse, and I thought it was so cute. And it just fit really well. And it was short, but not too short to make Grandma Nikki feel uncomfortable. So I actually bought these at Yoga Works. Hey! Hey, I'm pointing at Kendall because Kendall recently turned me on to a class at Yoga Works um, and got me like a trial membership over there uh, called Melt. I've talked about it a little bit in different things. But anyways, they have a little store up front and they had leggings on sale. And when I saw these, you know I had to buy them because it's like cotton candy clouds meets like cool, I don't know, like there's cool shapes on here, like triangles and stuff. And this is from the brand Onesie or Onzi. Onzi. <laughs> and their stuff is so cute. I have a sports bra from, bra from them that is also just as cute and very same type of vibe, but just a brighter, like brighter pinks, brighter purples. But <sighs> those leggings are so cute. Okay, another cute pair of leggings. Possibly some of the cutest leggings I've ever bought in my life. Kendall's eyes are getting very big. These are also from Show Me Your Moo Moo, and they're right here. Kendall's dying. These are so flipping cute, and every time I've worn them, everyone and their mother stops me. So showmeyourmoomoo.com did a great job on that fabric choice, and they made them into a couple things. I actually got another item in that same fabric that you'll see. So next up, we have this Free People leather jacket. And the irony is I bought this for Nashville. Like I thought, this looks really Nashville. I wear my ripped up jeans or my dress and then this. 
It was so hot in Nashville. I don't think I wore a jacket a single day I was there, which says a lot because I'm freezing all the time. But it fits me, I think it fits me really, really well. And I think it's really cool for like, whatever, whether I want to wear like that Mexico dress and something light, and not the red one, the white one, um, or you want to wear like torn up jeans and a t-shirt, like you could just go really basic with this. I just think it's, it's really cool. And it just felt cool to me. That's the only way I can word that. So, all right, another showmeyourmoomoo.com purchase. I'm all about big comfy sweaters and I wear leggings 24 seven. So long ones that cover my butt are like, my goal and I love this it's basically like furry like a cat not like a cat totally not like a cat but like some other furry thing and it's just gray and white stripes and it's so soft and comfy and I just think it's just so it's actually from their line Moo Moo Mellow that's cute because this is definitely a mellow piece another target piece that I got when I was in Nashville shopping with Lucy who Lucy and I should never shop together probably like you and I should never shop together but I did it because everything she's all yes girl yes yes get that so this is from Morona and this is just a very light denim um but it's a denim and it's light blue and I just thought it was cool it was cute it was different than anything I've owned. And once again, like over that white dress, or you could mix your denims and I just think it's cool. So thanks Target. This was a Kendall pick. She threw her arms up in the air. Hey, this is from Forever 21 and this is so cute. I am still personally pondering the way I wanna wear this. I have a really cute pair of like really holy jeans yeah. that fit really tight. That'd Cause be with really all cute. the flowiness, I feel like you'd want your You'd want to show your silhouette underneath yeah. and keep it pretty basic. So, but isn't this so cute? I love it so much. I got this jumper from Wild Fox. You guys know Wild Fox jumpers are like the softest on the planet. And it's just a pink pineapple jumper. Super cute. I also see myself bringing this to Mexico for like lazy mornings when I go to get breakfast. It's like short jean shorts, throwing on my jumper, my sunglasses, and just like shuffling into my breakfast buffet. I don't know why I assume I'm having a breakfast buffet, but... I got this bomber jacket from Lorna Jane and I got it because it made me feel like I was in the movie Grease and like I was one of the pink ladies. Now I will say with something like this, I'd probably keep everything else like very basic, like a white t-shirt, black jeans, black booties or black converse or like just really simple because this really is like a 12 year old jacket, which is fine and no offense to you if you're 12, but I'm 30. So not that I ever dress my age anyways, but still. Next up, this top I got from an independent store that an Instagrammer opened in Nashville. I think it's called like sons and daughters or fathers and sons or some kind of relationship something. I, like I said, I will try to have everything linked below. Um, but this is just a bright yellow crop top. And I specifically got this because I have a few high-waisted things now in my closet. And I don't have a lot of crop tops. And it's just cool. It's linen. The only thing is you literally have to be with someone to wear this because it buttons in the back. And like, how? How would you ever do this? You wouldn't. So you got to be with a homie in order to wear it. We have this long sleeve top from Zella, which is really, really basic. But I picture this for the days when I just wanna, I just kinda wanna wear something basic, like a long sleeve gray tee, gray tee which would be the best I guess, with my jeans or whatever. I mean, you can dress it up, but I just kinda wanted something simple. I wear through gray tops pretty fast and I'm always attracted to them. So Kendall's shaking her head, yes. So this top uh, is also from Forever 21. I've worn it a couple times and when I've worn it, Everybody's always like, where did you get that top? So cute. Isn't it super cute? It looks way cuter in person. It does, huh? It yeah. kind of looks almost like if Madewell were to produce a graphic mm -hmm. tee, like it could be something like this because it's just a bunch of like cacti print and items and succulent type things it looks like. No, it's all cacti and like leaves. So cute. I've gotten stopped every time I wore it and I literally think it was like $4.90 or something crazy like that. I got a Madewell top, another really basic top, but I liked the construction of it. It felt very like folksy and down home and it's this cream color like this, just kind of goes down like that, kind of straight. And um, on the back, it crosses like that. One of my favorite tops that I purchased in this whole haul, and I feel like sitting on this hanger is not even kind of gonna do it justice. It's from Free People, and it's just so like hippie-ish, and the lace detailing I think is so pretty. It's all very like, it's just very casual, but also detailed, and I just 
Love it. Next up, I have a weird obsession with space, so I got this at Target Nashville. Woo! Which is ironic because when you think about it, like NASA is actually just like a government space program, but that's cool. I just, yeah, I like space, so it doesn't need any explanation. I just wanted a fun graphic tee. Okay, this top I got from Urban Outfitters. This, funny enough, is one of Dan's favorite tops from the whole shopping spree. Dan is really into like gray, black, that's pretty much it. And so when I get things that have kind of like cool cuts or lines and are a little more basic, he likes the design personally. So this top has the cold shoulders and it goes long, so it's not steamed right now, but you could totally just get away with wearing this with like leggings and ballet flats or motorcycle boots if you wanna grunge it up or whatever. Okay, so I got this cold shoulder black Madewell top and it's super cute because not only do you have the cold shoulder here, but then you also have like a hole over here where the bows tie. It's shorter, which I wasn't sure how I felt about that at first, but I really like it and I'm planning on getting like some kind of leather belt that I can start wearing when shirts go shorter but they're not cropped. So it's not just the top of my jeans. I can like add something kind of cool there. So I really like it. Next up, actually Dan loves this top. He loves this top and I haven't worn it yet because I had to get like a new bandeau because I feel like that's the only bra I can wear with this. But it's from American Eagle and it goes in the front up like this. This was a this was one of the ones that you pulled. I can't remember mm -hmm. when I'm going through them. I can't remember. But I am pretty sure you pulled this and Dan it. loves it. <laughs> Next up, I told you I upgraded my entire wardrobe. Free people. So cute. This was definitely one of yours too. Uh -huh. It's so, I just love it. I love the faded rainbow. I love that the rainbow colors are different than usual rainbow colors that people pull. And it's just cool and laid back and I love it. Okay, so show me your moo moo. This top is so cute. It's just a bunch of seashells. Yeah, seashells, that's how you word it. But it's a muscle tee, so it goes on the side. So I thought it'd be really cute with um, the bandos that I ordered. I actually ordered three bandos, but I can't show you any of them because the ones that came were not the right size, so I had to send them back. But I thought that'd be really cute with the bando for the summer. Then I'm presenting this to you so crappy because I washed it in a, she's just threw her hands up, but I washed this in a laundry, like a lingerie bag because I thought, oh, I don't want it to snag. But then I forgot and I put it in the dryer and it dried all crumpled. So what I actually need to do is kind of re-wet these and stretch it out and then steam it. But it's a set from American Eagle. How flipping cute is that? And I actually wore this to Disneyland and everybody was like, where'd you get that from? Like people were stopping me in the park. It's like American Eagle. So then I got some green cargo shorts for the summer. They're cute, huh? From Target. I thought they were cute and basic. Oh, with this, with my Madewell tank. Yeah, you can't ever go wrong with basic gray striped tanks. That's a good little combo right there. Mm -hmm. Then I got this dress. For, and are you pointing at the dress or the pile that I saw? It's the dress. It's so cute I didn't on. I think it'd be cute. Oh my gosh, it's so cute. I wore it out, I think in Nashville. Yeah, it was Nashville. And people were stopping me and they're like, that's so cute. It's so simple. It's just a t-shirt dress, but the center, hi Dan. The center has this little knot tie and cutouts and it's just, it's so cute because it's simple, it's casual, but it's still like something to it. Another show me your moo moo piece in that same print. These are little running shorts. So cute for like lounging around on a hot day in your tank, going for a walk, bringing them to the pool. Then I got this free people top, which I literally love so much. It's got a peplum waist. Yeah, Kendall's throwing her arms up in the air again. Love she that. loves this. She picked this one out and it's got a low back to it and it's kind of muscly again in the sense like you want to wear like a bandeau or whatever and it shows it. It's so, so good on me It's so cute. Uh, this is my birthday dress. Everybody asked about this dress um, in the videos and in my pictures and this dress is actually from Tilly's and it's ironic because I almost didn't buy this dress because I for some reason thought I don't know if it's going to be the best quality. I don't know if I'm going to like it. It might be kind of weird. I got it. I love it. It's so cute. Um, it's from a brand called Gypsies and Moondust. Okay. So I originally thought for my birthday, I wanted to wear tutus. So I had Kendall pick me out two tutus. So I haven't even worn these yet, but they're so cute. And I know that once I buy like that leather belt I was talking about that I will wear these because I think what I'm going to do is kind of like countryfy these up like they're more kind of glam because they're a tutu like this one's so cute short underneath with long tulle on the bottom and then this is just a straight midi 
black tutu. I got a bunch of leggings because I live in leggings. And this first pair is currently turned inside out, but uh, isn't this purple beautiful? I got these from Athleta because, um, so this pair I picked, but originally when Kendall sent me the birthday list over, she had this pair from Athleta and I had never bought anything from there. So cute. Every time I wear them, Dan's like, that pink is the, per it's perfect. It's so cute. Because I also got <laughs> this pair from Athleta too. They're cropped, striped, super cute. So it's such a cute little like, trio I got and I actually think I have an yes I do I literally got four pairs of leggings from Athleta this pair is a marble pair how cute is that so it's just like wearing marble on your legs and they're super cute so all four of those pairs were from Athleta super thick then I got these sweats from Wild Fox so cute so simple so comfy cozy as is pretty much everything you ever get at Wild Fox then I have got this free people top. So cute. If you saw my Nashville vlog, this is the top that I wore over to Tiffarelli's house when we did the breakfast bonfire in the back. Then I got two tops, um, the exact same top, just different colors. I thought I was gonna have to return these because they're so freaking tight. And these are medium larges. Look at how, t in what world, free people, is this a medium large? Please explain, it's not. In children's sizes maybe? I don't know. But it's so, the cut is so cute. It's meant to be skin tight because it goes in. You can't tell, but you'll see in the little shot. Um, it's just a really cute cut for both of them. And I wore the dark one all around Nashville. And the yellow top, I actually was trying on recently because that top, that show that I went to, or that store that I went to, that's the Instagrammer store, I actually bought this skirt, which I know it's very different for me. Melissa was like, I don't even know how you're gonna wear this. But when I paired this, with this free people top kind of like the modern cleanness of this top with this was so cute and i'm actually thinking this is a midi skirt um and i don't ever wear heels or wedges or anything so sometimes midis feel a little bit weird to me i'm like do i look weird i'm actually thinking of having this hem taken up a little bit so it's a shorter skirt next up i got this top from tilly's i need more space i told you guys i really like space related things and items then another show me your moo, moo item. Oh my gosh, guys, this is bananas. If my mom is watching this, she's gonna lose it. I love you, mom. So I tried to turn it inside out, but it's just this long top situation. Could be a dress. Really, it's like a top dress type situation. Love the colors. Then this is another Target Nashville purchase, and it is a high like neckline halter type situation. I just thought it was really basic, really cute, very like all American. 4th of July for sure. Then these look freaking tiny. Like I didn't even, I don't even know how these fit me. Well I do because they're super stretchy and they're very, very, very short. But these are from Lululemon. How cute are those? So flipping cute. The color is way brighter and it's translating on camera. And I just wanted them for summer for working out, for walking around the house, for wearing out if it's 110 degrees here like it gets sometimes. This, okay, this is actually Dan's favorite purchase. But it's a bralette <laughs> and it is so, it's so perfect and cute on. Um, the shape, this is the one thing you will not see me trying on guys. Isn't that so cute? Next up, I got my new favorite sweater from Athleta. And um, it's this gray sweatshirt like this. Dan's extremely jealous because he wants a sweatshirt that is similar to this in the sense that like, it's very well made. You can tell like the zipper quality, the, you can just, there's so much detail to the sweatshirt. Um, there's even inside pockets, outside pockets, thumb holes. It's like got this whole neck thingy with like a really good quality hoodie. It's just a really, really great quality sweatshirt. Definitely the best quality sweatshirt I have. This is a pick from Kendall. It is so flipping cute. I can't even handle it. When I put this on, I keep referencing Dan, but I can't help it, my love. When I put this on and I came out of the room, he was like, what? That is so cute. I was like, I know. And I wore it in Nashville with red, red high top Converse. It was so cute and so easy to get dressed. I just like put this on in my Converse and it looks like, wow, I'm so stylish. And I just like put two things on my body. So next up, um, it's just this long, or not long, it's very short actually dress. This was, I think from Tilly's. Mm -hmm. Yeah, so I didn't even know Tilly sold free people. Um, another Kendall pick. And I love how low it goes in the front. 
But to me, it doesn't feel scandalous because I would wear like a bralette or a um, bandeau and it keeps it like covered and I like kind of the skin peeping through and obviously I wear my biker shorts and I just flounce around like a princess and I love it so much. This is actually not super current, but Kendall convinced me in my closet. She's like, you have to show them because it's still, I got it recently-ish in life, just not in this same, not in the last few weeks. It's been a couple months, um, but it's this Ted Baker bag. Isn't that cute? I love this shade of pink. I have been a Ted Baker fan for so long. Ted Baker and Kate Spade to me are very like in the same kind of vein and I just, it's so cute. So moving on to shoes, I got finally red high top Converse. I am definitely a Converse person, I have figured out. Um, not all the time because really like support my feet, but when I'm trying to have like stylized tennis shoes for a look, I love Converse. So these are the Converse I wore with that gingham jumper. Then I got a pair of shoes from the brand Peter Nappy in um, Nashville. And it's a like Italian mercantile leather goods kind of place. And their shoes literally can run like 500 to a thousand dollars. And they were having a sample sale. So I got two pairs of shoes, this is one of them, for $150. So so I got these kind of like high top, mid top tennis shoes and I loved the color of this shoe. I just thought it was really cool. I got boots that I have, I have no boots that are even kind of like this. The color, the shape, everything. They're just low ankle cut booties and I feel like these would be so cute with like distressed, like my holy jeans. I could literally just distress jeans, white t-shirt and then like that leather jacket from Free People because I feel like there's like flower colors in there that would be really cute with it. So super cute. Then from Kendall, I got these Adidas tennis shoes and these are really awesome. I have hardly even had them for like a month and I've worn them so much. The support that they give my feet, the cuteness of the shoe, and then now apparently the way that they wash because I threw these in my lingerie bag because I'd worn them to death and I was like, I need to wash these and I washed them and they came out great, perfectly fine, totally washed clean. Okay, I'm calling these Birkencrocs because they're Birkenstocks. They're from Birkenstock, but they are literally croc material. So um, a little bit out there, but actually I've been going to class sometimes to melt wearing those pink yoga pants with these pink Birkencrocs. And it's pretty amazing. Dan's like, those shoes were made for those pants. I'm like, I know. That is it, guys. That brings us to the end of the haul. Saying that's it feels like a joke because definitely the largest shopping spree I've done in all 30 years on this planet. Oh, and I bought these pearl earrings. <laughs> Seriously guys, uh, I hope that you like this. I hope you got some like style inspiration for upcoming the rest of 2017. Don't forget to go over and check out Kendall's channel. You did a great job, Kendall. Oh, thank you. Shop. Thank you, thank you. You really did. Um, this is one thing I really like about Kendall and I think that you will like about her channel and her blog and her Instagram is you've really like infused me with so much life again towards Yay. how I'm dressing. I feel like for a long time I had kind of like lost my spark and passion in like how I dress. And not that that's something everybody needs, but if that's something that was a passion of mine yeah. for so long, and you've like reawakened it in me. And she does that as a person. She brings life to you, like you. through the screen, through her pictures. <laughs> and I just really think you should go check her out oh, and subscribe. You. Well, it, you know, clothes make you feel good. And if you wear do. clothes that make you feel better, you feel, you inspire people. Yeah. You, your attitude's better. It is. And I will say that this obviously costs a lot of money to do this, <laughs> but prior to Kendall reigniting my passion, I wasn't doing like huge shopping sprees like this. And I think that just that point is true. That like yeah. taking the time to like figure out how you want to get dressed yeah. is just really fun. And it's fun. Yeah. And yeah, so check out Kendall. I think you're going to really enjoy watching her grow up, watching Yay. her stuff evolve. <laughs> I will see you guys back here very soon with another new video. I hope you're having a great day. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel if you haven't already turn on those bell notifications and go check out my vlog channel to see my Nashville vlog and other vlogs that I'm putting out so yeah yay I'll see nice you to meet you guys nice to meet you guys it was nice to meet you guys it was so nice for her to meet you guys so we will see you soon okay bye guys